Hi, my name is Roger and welcome to the channel. This is just gonna be a quick look on Arturia's new plugin Augmented Strings Intro and see if it is for you. So Arturia, the French company, just released a new plugin, Augmented Strings Intro. They're gonna release a full version, but the intro is free for you to download until the end of this month, April 2022. The plugin is a hybrid between sampled strings and synthesizers, and you can morph between those in different ways. Probably you're gonna have more control in the full version than you have in this intro version. I don't know if this plugin is for me or not, but I will show you what it can do, and maybe it is for you. How it sounds, well, you've heard it already. It's what's been playing in the background. This is how the plugin looks like when you open it up. You've got a morph knob in the middle and then some tweaking knobs around it doing different things. And the first sound you will hear is this. And if I morph it to the right, we get a synthesizer. An arpeggiated synthesizer. And we can blend them two together then. Let's go for another sound. Let's go for Explore Tomorrow. What is that? Rather beautiful pad, actually. Another sound. Let's go for Pop Staccato. The time is uh, attack or release, it's not both. Motion is the groove, effects A and effects B is not on all patches. Could be things like chorus and things like that. The color is a filter. Sometimes it's brighter to the left and sometimes it gets brighter to the right. This, I believe, gets darker to the right. Yeah, and then we have delay and reverb. Uh, one more patch. Hazer, what is that? Mm, that could be cool. This plugin takes up a lot of CPU, so if you're gonna use it, I recommend that you bounce it to audio when you have programmed it the way you want to, because it's gonna eat up your CPU, unless you have a super fast, super duper Ferrari computer or something. What I did for my demo is that I just put some Apple loops in for the drums, drum, maracas, and tambourine, and then bass from augmented strings. I don't have any effects on this. It's only the built-in effects in the plugin. I only allowed myself to use a little bit of EQ to fit them together. Bass help, I call this track. And then some pizzicato. It's actually a combination of pizzicato and spiccato, and you morph them together. It sounds like that. Arpeggiated synthesizer, which I automated with a filter. Like that, and a string pad. So tell me, is this plugin for you or not? Probably not for me, except for inspiration. I have a few plugins that I pull out some time to get inspiration and I get ideas for new songs, new sounds, new textures. So tell me in the comments if you like this plugin. And also if you like updates like this and tips and tricks for the studio and showing the life of a musician, please consider subscribing to my channel. Channel in Swedish is Kanal. Kanal. Until next time, Roger that.